Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So before we get into this, I'm gonna put the comment of the day up and if you guys wanna take part in it, all you have to do is leave a comment and I randomly choose them for my new notifications. We're back with late night, you guys. It has been a hot minute, I apologize for that. But a lovely commenter said that I could possibly find Danny Harris by becoming a jock and also i thought about checking oh girl don't don't move your head like that when when, you, when you're paused that just don't do that we're not doing that horror movie shit uh, i thought we could check the social groups because i forgot that you can meet other sims down here uh and then i also forgot that i have the mod where we can throw a party and literally invite anyone in town so i don't know why i was so dramatic and thought that i would never see danny harris again i'm just gonna throw a juice kegger tonight and see if he comes over. <laughs> so that is the plan. Today we have our lecture. She's pretty grossed out by Stinky Pits. Uh, Lori over here. She's smelling pretty, pretty terrible it seems like. Uh, but we're getting a phone call so let's go ahead and see who that is and then we're gonna go to our lecture around noon. We'll probably leave about 11. Oh is it Yi Gangnam? It is. So let's see are we getting invited to a party or are we just like wanting to chat with her? Because either way, all right we're gonna go ahead and say sure she wants to chat with us and get rid of our trash because you know we're not gonna be stinky and trashy like her but we're going to our lecture and the only problem about having a party is tomorrow is going to be wednesday which means we have to uh get up at 8 a.m but you know we can we can take a nap in class it's no big deal so i think what i'm gonna do is have her go ahead and throw the party and kind of get it all planned out and we're gonna do a juice kegger because you know that seems good and we have this and then we do have a juice kegger upstairs so we should be good to go and hopefully it will be a good turnout uh i think we have legendary host yes we do so that's perfect uh let's go ahead and say goodbye to yi gangnam because i do want to get our party kind of all scheduled out so we don't have to worry about it we do have to do this opportunity but i'm not too concerned about doing it tonight because I want to make sure that we have enough time to have our party and have a good time and hopefully we don't get arrested and have a whole whole ordeal like we did before. So we're going to schedule our, I almost said gift giving party, uh, juice kegger for probably, let me see, 6 p.m.? We're going to go ahead and say 6 p.m. and it's just going to be casual attire. And let me see, okay, friends, we just have Jeffrey Dean, which is totally fine. We're going to bring Jeffrey Dean. Hannah Germanata, Samantha Gray, uh, Che, Derek, Eddie, of course, Eddie Mullis. Let's take a look at all of the people in the town. And I am really, 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 really hoping that Danny Harris is going to be in it. But I'm also looking to see if there's anybody else that I would like to invite. Muggsy is a jock. So I'm going to bring Muggsy over because he is a jock. Um, let's see. Ashley Corona, she is a jock, I think. I'm pretty sure her and Ashley DeSorrento are both jocks. Maybe, maybe not. Uh, let's see. Miles, I love Miles Forthright. Let's see. Danny Harris, where are you? I guess we can invite Yi over. Why not? And Dan there he is. There he is. Okay, I was getting a little concerned. Okay, so we're gonna invite him over and zoe you are super pretty so i'm gonna invite you over and let's see is there anybody else that i want to invite is hank or scott i think hank is the jock and scott is the the nerd so we're gonna take hank i almost said scott well scott's a vampire so you know what what you can come over to and i guess that should probably be it i don't want to overdo it even though we've we're, we're definitely overdoing it. Orchard Vandal. Uh, we can invite the Grim Reaper, but uh, you know, we're not quite ready for that. We're just going to invite, yeah, we're just going to invite them and it'll be at 6 p.m. since, you know, we just have our one class today. So hopefully it will turn out to be quite good. What, what is that? Did you pass out? Vicky like straight up passed out because she is so exhausted. Girl, you kind of scared me there. I'm not going to lie. I'm like, what the hell just She's happened? She's heading off to her lecture. Like I said, we're going to skip cameoing in the play for now. Uh, what's not super important because I want to make sure that, you know, we have our party and we kind of get in with some of the social group uh, that we have going on. And I also want her to complete, which we're very, very close the uh charisma skill right here for everybody's best friend that way your friends skip good friend and jump immediately to best friend so we'll be able to make friends quickly which will probably help us out in the 
uh, celebrity world and we already have eight best friends so we only need to make two more best friends and we are very very close to being best friends with Jeffrey Dean and also Sid so those will be the two sims that I kind of you know hopefully we'll be able to become best friends with or at least close to it but we're going to sit in our lecture and I hope I hope she doesn't fall asleep I hope she actually does some work because I do want her to be you know in a good place she's actually doing really well right now so I'm happy about that she's going to level up her charisma and let's see who do we have we have eddie mullis passed out over here we have Derek khan who is listening and che is just passed out but it looks like she's going to be listening i hope she doesn't fall asleep we're listening to madeline i don't know what the hell she's talking about but i i just hope she doesn't fall asleep okay we got a level six in our charisma which is really really good and she wants to use a charming introduction which hopefully we will and she also wants to throw a great party which i sure as hell hope that we do order pizza we might have to do that for um our party tonight but we're just gonna chill in our class and you know do our thing i really wanted her to become the mascot and maybe we will be able to uh, but we'll have to see. Oh, he woke up from his slumber. Do you, he's gonna ask you what the hell's been going on while I'm sleeping. Like, that's probably what he's going to ask. I thought she was about to fall asleep. I was gonna say, girl, I'm gonna wake you up because we are not We're being this. disturbed from our classwork to be asked for an autograph by Mr. Derek Khan. But the good thing is, since we're in the classroom, we still get a boost in our performance. But we're gonna give him our autograph because you know it's Derek Khan and you know he's just he's just a very cute sim I was gonna try to do a charming introduction but we're just gonna we're gonna do our thing here yeah did you enjoy that my friend let's see can we just do a little chit chat with you maybe see what your sign is and what's going on with you maybe maybe we'll be attracted to you and see what's going on since we're, we're here we're still getting a performance boost so I might as well take advantage of it and get to know you and see if you are, you know, worth it. Uh, who are you? Who are you? Are you paparazzi? No, but you might as well be because you got that phone pulled out taking pictures of me, girl. I did not ask you so to do that. So one thing about Derek is he hates children. He dislikes children and we have them. So it's probably, girl, don't look at me like that. Just because you don't have some hot guy to talk to, do not even give, yeah, look away, bitch. That's what I thought. Don't even do that. So basically, we spent our entire time in class just talking to Derek, you know, just talking to him and pretending that we were doing work, but she still got a pretty good performance out of today. We're actually doing really well, so I'm not worried. You know what? Do not even knock my umbrella, all right? I know that it's janky. I know that I need a new one. No, we're not having our photo taken. We have to go home and get things taken care of. Everybody hates my umbrella. I just I just need to sell it. I need to sell the umbrella and get a new one because we're upsetting literally everyone. Uh, it, but you know, whatever, it's fine. We we just need a new one. It's no biggie. Now, now uh, we need to go home so we can get ready for our party, okay? Everybody is coming over here asking for my autograph. No, I just want to go home. I want you to leave so me alone. It looks like our juice kegger will be starting soon. Make sure to have a keg filled and music blasting when guests arrive. I have her taking a nap since, you know, I want to make sure she is well rested. I don't think we have anything we do well you know what i'm gonna put one down here i'm gonna put something for music down here and also another juice kegger because i want to make sure that you know my guests have a good time and i'm gonna put it like literally right in the middle of things and we're going to get a stereo of some sort um let's use the one that came with the university since you know they want us to be blasting music we're going to do so so let's just turn on the music and see what kind of happens yeah i needed you to wake up anyways because everybody is going to be arriving soon and you're just gonna have to deal with it so i'm just i'm just waiting the first guest has arrived i ah! oh my god okay i so sorry if I broke your guys' ear, but I'm so excited. Look who's here. <gasps> the one and only Danny Harris is here. I'm so excited. Oh my god. I did not mean to scream like that. Oh my god. I have a problem. Let's, yeah, I get it. I get that that really woke you up, but what I need you to do, <gasps> they're attracted to each other. I need you to do a charming introduction to him. Please go over there. Okay, that was a little bit of a crazy look, but I. 
am so happy right now. Like, hi, Danny. Please don't let me get arrested again. Okay, somebody's running around. Oh, we've got a couple of them. Just running around. Okay, doing their thing. Oh, my God. <laughs> she is so beautiful. Okay, I, I need to be your friend. She is a rebel. I am obsessed with her. She is so damn cute. Okay, um, Muggsy is attracted to us, but I really could care less about Muggsy. I am obsessed with- okay, wait, 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 he- he has- oh, okay, we have some- oh, okay, so much is happening. Hold the phone. He has commitment issues, so perfect, me too. He's Vertuso, and he can't stand art. That's- kind of not good but we you know it's fine we're we're incompatible in one way but you know compatible in another so we're gonna have an argument after we just were really good but you know whatever we're gonna also consume some plasma juice but i really need to chat with that girl zoe because she was so pretty i've never seen her before i know you guys are not leaving already Zoe, where did you go? Here you are. I have never seen this sim before, but my god, she is so pretty. So she was impressed with what we have to say. Uh, she's a bookworm, and we have the shared trait, so we are just gonna chat with her. Well, maybe not the bookworm. We have the, uh, we have the artistic is what I was looking for here, but we need to grab some plasma juice and then kind of have some fun because I really want her to have some fun. And I want her to, what are we doing here? No, we're not having our photo taken by literally everybody. It's just not going to happen. It's just not going to happen. We have so many Sims here, but I do want her to enjoy her night. I was going to have her order a pizza, but I think I'm just going to have her, you know, do her thing, get some plasma juice, and then see if we can do a keg stand. And maybe, maybe we can invite Danny to do a keg stand with us. Uh, I think it's kind of funny. They both have the commitment issues uh, trait, which is a little interesting. Maybe that'll make it work. Okay, is this Jacob? Is this Jacob? Yeah, I think that's Jacob Salamander. Where did Danny go? I don't see him. I, I no longer see him, and I'm a little worried. Danny, where did you go? Well, at least we've made friends with you, so if you disappear, uh, we can bring you back somewhere? I don't know. Is that him out here? Somebody's out here. Uh, who's this? Carly? No. I don't know if Danny left or if I'm just missing him because there are so many sims here. Let's see. Do a keg stand. No, he's here somewhere. I just don't know where. So we're going to try to do a keg stand with him. Ooh, they brought so much food. It's too bad that she is a vampire. Uh, I, I still don't know if I'm going to have her keep the whole vampire thing or if we're going to... Um, let me see. I'm putting some of this food away. Or all of it. Not that it matters, because it's not like I'm going to have any of it. Uh, here he is. Uh, but I, I don't know if I'm going to have her keep the vampire trait. I do want to explore it a tad bit, obviously, because, you know, late night. Um, but I don't, I don't know that she will keep the whole vampire thing up. I want to, I want to get to know him. I want to know if he's single. I just want to chat with him and I hope we don't get arrested. That's all that I can say is I don't want him, don't want us to get arrested. Yeah, I don't really want him to get arrested either, but we're going to ask him to sign in stuff because, you know, why not? Let's, let's see. Ask your single, ask alma mater. Wait, which one did we do? Hold on. What do we ask? Sign, ask alma mater and ask if single. Is her phone ringing again or is it somebody else? I think it's somebody else this time. Okay, somebody's got a fire out here. There's no police around. <gasps> oh my god, as I say that, there's no police around and now they're here. Oh my god, we didn't even get a warning. So he's attending La, La Fromage Art School and graduated Sims University with a degree in physical education. Okay, so we're going to have to break this party up because the cops just pulled up, you guys. Did you see that? Why does that have to happen? Where's the breakup party? Where is it? Where is it? Breakup party. We got, no, we're, we don't have time for autographs. We have time for everybody to get the hell out of here because I am not getting arrested again. Like, who is this? Oh, Samuel, you're kind of, you know, you, you kind of fine. Maybe I do want to get arrested. Uh, actually, no, no, I, no, no. Can you just leave? Can we just, can you just go away? Can we just make you leave? How about we do a friendly introduction and you we'll, we'll try to be charming and maybe you'll think that we're really, you know, not up to no good. How dare them come here to try to ruin my party so dang quickly. But at least everyone had a blast 
in that short amount of time. So I went ahead and introduced myself to him and I'm gonna see if we can just, can you leave? Like, I want you to leave. I do not want you to be here, but maybe I shouldn't have even, I don't know. I'm I'm trying to be good because I don't want my poor Sim to be all reset again and then have a nightmare. And then it's just, I just don't want that. I just do not want that. Oh my God, you guys, she wants to kiss Danny for the first time out of all of them. She wants to kiss Danny. See, I told you. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I just, maybe I just, it's in my mind that I feel like I need to be with him all the time. But, uh, yeah, she wants to kiss him for the first time. Maybe we will be able to. You never know. We might, maybe we'll invite him out and go on a date I tomorrow. I have Piper working pretty hard today. And then, you know, you can see her fun coming down. And then I have her come out and listen to Tabcast. And that kind of brings her fun up a little bit. But she is just about done. And her class performance is now really really good uh actually she's stressed out the poor girl uh but we're gonna listen to our tabcast when we come out of class and we're going to invite danny harris out and maybe see if we can get to know him since she wants to kiss him for the first time so let's go ahead and invite him out and see if he is interested uh where should we go we have the bowling alley over here bees bolorama the grotto, isn't he a jock? So he would probably like to go bowling. So maybe we'll go bowling and then maybe grab some coffee afterwards. We'll see how, how this kind of goes. Uh, he might say no, so we might not be going anywhere at all, but I'm hoping he is gonna say yes. Please tell me he's going to. Sure, that sounds like fun, let's meet there. Perfect, don't laugh at me. Ronnie, I will knock you out. Oh, maybe you're just excited. Maybe you're excited to see me. Well, that's what it is. Okay, I thought he was gonna judge me for a minute and I was gonna beat him up. <laughs> Not really. I sold her umbrella because so many people were upset with me and it was making me self-conscious. So I'm gonna have to get her a new, <laughs> a new umbrella because The Sims made me feel really bad about my broken umbrella. So we just got here and I'm waiting and I'm waiting to see if he's here. We need to consume some plasma juice. I think we have a couple of plasma fruit. We do. Uh, Danny's coming over to chat with us. Oh my God, why am I way too excited that he is here? I, I have no idea. I have no clue why I'm this excited, but we're gonna go ahead and eat the plasma fruit to kind of help us out and maybe go bowling. Oh, we can come over here and also sing karaoke. Also, you might hear my cat meowing in the background because, you know, it's almost three in the morning and he decided to wake up and... Uh, you know, just be a part of this video. So apologize for that, but we're just gonna see what, what we got going on here. So what do we know about him? What are all of his traits? Let me check really quickly. So he's virtuoso, commitment issues, and can't stand art. We don't know the others. He's a damn Scorpio, which I forgot about. Oh, well, we'll just have to, we'll just have to deal with it. Uh, let's see, what else can we do? Maybe let's ask how his day is. I, I really want to know what his other what his other traits are. Uh, let's see, can we get to know you maybe? Hypnotic gaze, maybe we can do read mind. Uh, let's read his traits because I really do want to know what his other traits are out of curiosity. Okay, he might not be into that, but he seems to he seems to be okay. Uh, so he has a good sense of humor. Okay, so he's actually not that bad. I mean, commitment issues, we have it as well. Can't stand art. Hey, Binks, I enjoy that you just jumped right up on my chair and scared the absolute crap out of me. Uh, but we're going to come over here and we're going to bowl with Danny Harris and have just a little bit of a romantic night. Try to kiss him, possibly. Because, you know, since she wants to do that, also, that was him jumping off of my chair. <laughs> if you're new here, th these are all new sounds in the background. If you've been here for a while, you already know. Uh, what do you, so you don't, you don't like Ann Connors? What did she do to you? Girl, what did you, oh, Connie Cronk. Ann Connors. Who the fuck is Ann Connors? I don't know. Is that a sim? Or am I, is it just a person's name that, get out of my life, uh, that just popped up? Uh, we're gonna bowl with him and let's see how, how she does, because... I don't, I don't know how good she's going to be. Uh, not great. Not great so far. Not great so far. He, he's laughing at her. He's laughing at her too. Like, what did she do to you guys that you're laughing at her? That's not very nice. Connie didn't do anything to you. All right, Danny, let's see what you have. 
Let's see what you have to offer here. Are you, are you good at bowling or are you going to do worse than me? Let's see. I hope you kind of fall, to be completely honest, uh, since you were making fun of Connie. But you did literally just as terrible as me, so I don't know I don't know what your problem is. But we're now, what is this, a wannabe in the social group with the jocks. So we get, let's see, it's starting to show. She can now do the school cheer and will receive opportunities to host juice kegger parties. So... That's always exciting. Oh my goodness, she actually did really well. She actually did really, really well. I'm gonna let him bowl one more time and then we're gonna try to get romantic with him and see if we can get in that kiss. And oh, my dog too, we love to see it. We love to see it. I'm not even cutting any of this out because you know, whatever. If you have animals, you know, they just wanna, you know, they just wanna show <laughs> that they're here. Okay, he didn't do so well this time, but we're going to stop bowling. First of all, let's answer the phone really quick just to see who it is. But Danny, I am going to get a little romantic with you. We're going to compliment your appearance. Appearance? Appearance? Wow. Answer your damn phone, girl. I know it's going to be literally nobody of importance, but uh, Che just... No, I don't want to go on a date with you. I'm in the middle of an almost date. We're not on a date. We're actually just like hanging out as friends, but... Let me see what he does here on his own. Let's see, no, not good. He is just not a good bowler. My dude is not good at this. All right, let's get romantic with him. And then we're going to have to head home because she does have some classes tomorrow. Or actually, I think tomorrow is her activity day. Let's see. Are you going to take the romantic? Oh, he's taking the romantic appearances. Yes, he is. Of course, he is. Compliment personality. We're officially on a date. We're doing really good here. Uh, let's flirt with him. Oh my, he is definitely into us. Okay, giving him a Morris hug. And then, of course, paparazzi is going to catch it on camera because what a creeper. <laughs> what a total creeper. Uh, we'll do a flirtatious joke. You know, he has a good sense of humor, so he, he might enjoy this. Oh, he thinks we're being alluring. We love to see it. How about holding hands and then we're gonna try to confess our attraction that's our attraction oh he's here for it i love his vampire teeth i think that is the whole thing i think the vampire teeth is 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 what it is <laughs> i think that's what the problem is here all right how, how, yeah, how are you feeling it do you want to do anything else with him do you want to do anything else with him no okay we're just gonna let her get oh they're gonna get their first <gasps> <laughs> they got their cute little friends to freaking kiss. I am so obsessed. I am so obsessed. Okay, so she got what she wanted. She got her first kiss with him. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and get ready to wrap this up. I'm going to say goodbye for the date. I kind of want to see what he says. Like, if he's going to be like, this is the worst date ever. He might, because it was a very short date. Uh, but he might have enjoyed it. Let's see. What does it say? We didn't spend much time together, but whatever. It's all good. Maybe we'll do more next time. Yeah, I wanted to get coffee, but I also need it too. Oh, what are you thinking about? What are you thinking about, Tammy Harris? You look like you got a lot on your mind. Uh, but in the next part, we are going to do some more schoolwork, obviously. But maybe we can go to the grotto or grab some coffee. I also would like to throw a party at that one park that's like super far away. I think that would be kind of fun, but we're going to just do, do some things here. We're going to enjoy our university time. And I'm very happy that I have found Danny Harris. I might give him a slight bit of a makeover, give him a different skin and, you know, some contacts and stuff. But either way, I'm very excited that, you know, we are here in this moment. So don't forget to leave a like on this video. If you guys are enjoying it, subscribe, turn on your post notifications, all of that fun stuff. I love you all and I'll see you in the next video.